Well, here I am in the world's worst school, and I'm trapped. Hello, everybody! I'm Kylie Kian, and welcome to Riddle School. A school made of riddles. Here's our first riddle. This button obviously proceeds to the main menu. Is that a riddle, or is it just telling me what to do? It's just telling me what to do. Let's start. John Bro presents Grown. Fair enough. I do appear to be trapped in a classroom, a, a very beat up, old, decrepit classroom, uh, with a teacher who appears to think that three plus zero is two. Solid mathematics there, teach. I've been sitting here for two hours straight listening to addition facts that are wrong, as we've established, all because I tease somebody. I'm in a special class. Don't be a bully. I mean, it's that easy, but also. So like, I don't know if this qualifies as, as a special class. I don't feel very special. I don't even have a smart teacher. <laughs> yeah, that's fair enough. Uh, right now I'm as free as a bird in a bird cage. It sounded nice for a second, then I realized that's not so nice. All right, that's it. I'm getting out of this school. What's 131 plus 42 again? I forget. You just remember that or like just do the math. It's 173. Look at that brain. I, I played enough Baldi's basics. Ugh. <laughs> he's he's dead. He just died of boredom. Riddle school. This is where we are now. I'm getting like intense Henry Stickman vibes, which makes me very happy. During school, even the windows look dreary. That's true. That's fair enough. Is there other things I can click on? Like my own head? No? Okay. What about the teacher? That's the teacher, Mr. Calm. Okay, Mr. Calm is very bad at math. Um, can I just, can I just leave? He asked me lots of questions because he doesn't know any of the answers. I love that. Oh, that's what a, what a great teacher. What about the light socket? No outlet here. What about this like broken part? You can tell this school's low budget just by looking at that. That's fair. South, go south. The teacher may not be smart, but he knows when I open that door. Oh, okay. What about the sharpener, pencil sharpener? That's it. Uh, it is? Hey teacher, could I sharpen my pencil? Only one person at a time. Okay. Do you need to sharpen your pencil? Cause it's just you and me, bud. Okay, I'm gonna go sharpen my pencil. That worked. Now that was sharp. What a pun. You nailed it, kid. You nailed it. Special class for the insane? I'm insane? Okay. Obviously, I need to figure out how to get out of here. It's the exit sign. It represents sweet, sweet freedom. Okay. Uh, can I just leave? The school doors are shut during school hours. They lock us in here. I can't help but feel like I might be in a prison. The principal has the keys. I was there yesterday, and then I got sent to that class. Only last time, I was with the teacher. It'll be harder this time. I don't even have a hall pass. There's a hall guard right before you reach the hall's end. Well, it's all the way down the hall and past the teacher's lounge. If I can make it there, I'm as good as free. Okay, so we've got stuff to do. Um, five for Prez. Five is a popular guy in this school. It's because of his vote five shirt. Is that all it takes? Let's head east, shall we? Wait, click on these lockers. Okay, let's just keep going. Water, water fountain, fair enough. Miss Coffee, Kofi? Let's go say hello to Miss Kofi. Oh gosh, oh my, my fellow students. Um, um, this guy, he does not look like he's okay. Are you, that Zach, who is always very cold. He has no problem freezing the water fountain. Oh my gosh. He's so, he's so cold. He freezes stuff around him. Zach, you might be an X-Man. Look how happy this dude is. That's Smiley. She's the only one in the school who likes learning. Uh, Smiley's also the one I made fun of to be in the special class. Okay, well, don't make fun of Smiley. She's just happy to be here, and that's Fred. I like PH Fred. My best friend and the most bored class member. He does look pretty bored. <laughs> What's going on with this painting? That's drawing by somebody named John Bro. John Bro's the guy who made this game, I think. What about Miss Kofi? Coffee? That's my teacher, Miss Coffee, who drinks more coffee than anyone else I know. What an appropriate name. She finishes teaching lessons two hours early in a hard to understand jittery voice. All right, class, let's do this. We're gonna go. Okay, we're done. Bye. And apparently, according to Miss Coffee, Earth is flat. Uh, I think that coffee's getting to you. 
Is there anything here for us? Can I click uh, the window? Looking out here reminds me I'm trapped here. Yep, that's fair enough. The trash. Wow, feather duster in a dustbin. Oh, okay. Is there anything else around here? It doesn't look like it. All right, let's head back out. Check the clock. It's a clock. It's also a reminder that I waste all my time at school. That explains why I never pay attention to clocks anymore. This is school prison. This is terrifying. Let's keep checking the locker. Oh, hello. Hall pass. Okay. That seems like that's going to be a critical part of getting out of this place. I mean, we kind of already talked about it. Janitor's closet. Let's go in there. What are you doing? Um, I was going to say, is this guy's name Bob? No, that's like a prison tag. 808. Uh, get out of my closet. Okay. 808. Um, see you around guy. Uh, wait, is there anything in there that I can take maybe? No. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm out. We're cool. We're cool. I'm not too sure about that. Uh, janitor um let's keep heading east shall we uh the bathroom uh sure oh that why is this stall so clean and this one is unbelievably disgusting not to mention all the the graffiti i love nobody five was not here good to know orange are my fave color it's same uh can we check this bathroom that's the untouched stall which is in perfect condition and currently on display we can't actually use it that's the only stall the guys ever use mainly for graffiti i can see that um as crazy as it sounds those are sinks just look at the sleek design i would have thought twice about escaping school if it all was that cool looking that's a sink all right if you say so um is there anything else that we can click on okay no let's keep heading east keep checking these these uh lockers hey it's me richie the hall guard got a hall pass actually richie i do there you go i do so please get out of my way <laughs> All right, I mean, he did get out of my way. Women's bathroom, probably should not go in there. But what if there's like important stuff in there that I need to escape this school? I'm just, <sighs> listen, if I went in there, you'd hear screaming and shrieks, not only from anyone in there, but from me. All right, fair enough. I'm sorry that I even tried. Keep going east. This school has seven students and more than 50 lockers. Yet yeah, now that I think about it, that is kind of insane. That's a poster I made at home because of the bizarre number of lockers in this school. This school has seven students and more than 50 lockers. No sanity. No wonder this school's so low budget. It was expected to be popular. Okay. I don't know if these numbers mean something to us. Perhaps they will mean something later. I mean, the name of the game is Riddle School. So we want to be like mindful of our surroundings which is something I'm bad at, but I'm gonna continue doing my best. Ugh, give me a cookie. It's Snorlax. It's human Snorlax. He is blocking our path. Um, I don't got no cookies. Can I get uh, the principal's office is past the teacher's lounge, but I can't get in. Chubb is in the way. Ugh. Where am I gonna find a cookie? Gotta keep checking these lockers. Maybe I can use the feather duster to, to clean something. I don't think so. Maybe I can give it to the janitor. Here, have this. Here, I don't want this. <gasps> You found my feather duster. Keep the change. He gave me money. You're welcome, 808. But I'm actually going to call you Bob. You know, because eights kind of look like a B. The playground birds needed dusting? Well, I gave you a dollar. Don't waste it on socks. Okay, Bob. Carry on, guy. That guy's a little weird. So now we have a dollar. What do we use it on? There's got to be like a vending machine where we can get maybe a cookie. Or maybe we can give a dollar to to one of the students? Let's go back to Miss Coffee's classroom. See if anybody wants this. You want this, Fred? What about you, cold guy? No? Okay, what about Miss Coffee? I just want a cookie. Should we go back to Mr. Calm? No way. Okay, don't go back to Mr. Calm. What am I gonna do with this dollar? Maybe I can use it in the bathroom or something. I don't know. Maybe I can give... Okay, I can give Chubb a dollar and, uh, and, and he can take it to to go get himself a cookie there you go teacher's lounge let's let's go in what are you doing here uh um i'm scared i need to talk to the principal oh these are options standing teacher or are you wrong room um let's say standing 
Get out! Wrong answer. Let's try again. Maybe we can, maybe we can uh, charisma our way out of this situation. Uh, what teacher are you? That's none of your business. Gosh, the people here are actually insane. I need to talk to the principal. And why is that? Um, my teacher set me up. That's pretty good. I think that's pretty good. You don't want your teacher on the phone, do you? What is wrong with this lady? Get out. Okay, all right, fine. Wrong choice, I guess. Can we keep going east? We can. What is going on in here? Um, okay. Uh, the cookie vending machine is unfortunately broken. Oh, poor Chubb. What's going on with the cafeteria? That's a diagram of the cafeteria reminding us all what it looked like clean. Interesting. What's going on with this kid? That's Greg, the least hungry and most restful student in school. Okay, Greg. Uh, that's the school famous Smiley Smudge. I'm glad that it has a name. That's how I made fun of Smiley with mustard. Okay, I don't know if that means something. That's green unrecognizable gunk. Fair enough. Someone managed to spill their blueberry wet aid up there. That's impressive. Uh, can we take this poster down? I see the little creak, the little crease on the corner. I was thinking maybe you could, you could peel it. No. Okay, fair enough. I don't think there's anything we can do in here right now. Maybe later? Let's see, East, uh, getting out of school through that door is out of the question. Fair enough, they literally have barbed wire around that door. I don't like this school. There has to be a combination of choices we need to make with this insane teacher to get out of this situation. What is it? I don't know. Um, let's continue this line of reasoning. I need to talk to the principal and then it's an emergency. Then go to the bathroom. Not that kind of emergency. What if the school was like on fire? Speaking of fires, what's going on with this fire extinguisher? I think I'm safe. The last fire we ever had was when Miss Coffee's coffee spontaneously combusted. What kind of coffee is this lady drinking? Let's try another combination. I need to talk to the principal. I want to tell him a joke. You're gonna love that. Oh, jokes are always fun. Go on. Really? That's the one? I tell her there's an emergency and she tells me to get out. I tell her I have a joke and she turns into the most normal human ever. I, I'm shocked, but I am going into the principal's office and this is a little scary. Mr. Qu Qu Quasech? Quis Queshi? I, I don't know what his name was. Dude, this guy is intense, but I did get the key. How nice of you to drop by. Bye then. Bye. Really? I'm out? I'm free? I never have to go back? Oh, baby. He has done it. John Bro's Riddle School defeated. Now go read a good book. I like it. So that was actually super awesome, but I have to let you guys know, there's actually five more episodes of Riddle School. This story is not done. So let me know if you guys wanna see more in the comment section down below. Maybe we'll return to the, the worst school ever. But for now, we say goodbye to the Riddle School hero. Bye buddy, don't cry. Please, please don't cry.